Did you know there's never been a book focusing on the life of Harrisburg's founder? David Beiser has been interpreting John Harris Jr. for more than 15 years and just released Visionary Road to the Capitol, the little known story of John Harris Jr. to really share the story of the man who founded our capital city. So this was John Harris's land that we're sitting on right now, which is the reason we thought the Capitol Rotunda was the best place to do this. Dolphin County Historical Society approached me about doing a first-person interpretation of John Harris. I, I said, yeah, you got me. All the things we would know, common knowledge to the average person living in that time period, I had to learn all of that common knowledge and information so that I could portray him in such a way that anybody could off the cuff ask me a question and I had to know the answer. You can ask him questions as if you were just going to ask John Harris a question and he'll be able to answer the question easily. So he did a lot of hard work in founding what was then called Paxton or Harris's Ferry. He would eventually in 1785 work with his son-in-law William McClay to name the city Harrisburg, designs the county, designs the county seat, donates the land so this was John Harris's land. He gets it named after his father, but he's really the one who gets put on the committee and makes sure that, that his father